What is going on? Welcome back to Mindful Games. I'm Bryce. In this video, I want to talk about the body game and six ways getting jacked makes you stronger on the inside. All right, let's get right into it. Now, in this video, I don't necessarily want to talk about the aesthetics of the body game, but I want to talk about how the grind and, and maximizing your physique and getting the best physique that you can, how that translates to your mindset. How does that bleed over and improve other aspects of your life? The first way that the body game and getting jacked makes you stronger on the inside is that it improves your masculine presence slash aura. How you show up in any room, how you show up in group settings, your presence is, is, is strengthened. It becomes stronger. And that stems from the confidence that you gain when you're on your journey. Once you start working out, you're in the mirror, you're seeing the gains happen, you start to feel a lot better about yourself. And that translates to how you carry yourself in the world, all right? It doesn't happen right away, and you may not even notice it right away, but it does become one of the most noticeable things about you that other people pick up on. How you show up, your frame, your posture, how you carry yourself. That's physical stuff I'm talking about, but like I said, it all stems from that confidence that you get from working out, all right? And it kind of exudes out of you. The second way that the body game makes you stronger is you get stronger discipline. All right. Now, if you work out at all, if you have any type of routine, you know that it takes discipline to be able to maintain it. A lot of people start off on this workout journey. They start, <laughs> you know, you see it a lot during New Year's and stuff like that. But a lot of people start on this journey and they're not really prepared for the work that it takes to maintain it. For example, when I get off work and I got to go to the gym after a long day of work, that takes a high level of discipline to be able to do that. And not everybody can do that. All right. But that's one thing that you'll start to notice too. You become more disciplined. And that bleeds over too. It bleeds over to other aspects of your life. The third way that you become stronger on the inside is that you develop a better relationship with yourself. You start to prioritize yourself. You start to prioritize the types of foods that you're eating, the sleep that you're getting. It even bleeds over into the people you surround yourself with. You know, you, you just start to embrace you as a person. You'll start to notice this over time. It may not happen right away, but you will develop more of a quality relationship with yourself once you start on this journey. The fourth way the body game and getting Jack makes you stronger on the inside is that you develop a stronger mind body connection. All right. Now, what am I talking about? So when you start working out, you know, and once you really start getting into it and you understanding what a muscle contraction is and, and how to actually squeeze certain things, you start to realize how that takes effort. That takes a mind body connection to be able to activate certain parts of your body to be able to kind of get the results that you want to get in the gym. All right. And the more that you're doing that, the more that you're getting the reps in of, of doing that mind body connection that will translate into everyday life as well. Say if you got to pick up a heavy box off the ground or something like that, you can't just bend down and just pick it up, round it back and everything like that. You're going, you're going to mess your back up. So what you start to develop is this, this awareness of yourself, awareness of your body and where you are in space. And you realize, all right, if I pick this up, I need to engage my core. I need to bend at my knees. So you start to improve that mind body connection when you get on this journey. The fifth way you get stronger with the body game is you develop more resilience. You become more of a resilient individual. Now, what I mean is when you're in the gym, and say, say you've been working out consistently for like a month or something like that, and then you miss a week. You know, being able to get back in your groove, being able to not let that setback throw you off so much to the point where you just give up, that's resilience. You're, you're working that muscle of getting back on the horse again if you get kicked off. And this, again, is going to translate to your everyday life. You're working that muscle of resilience. If you work out already, you already know that you're not going to feel like going to the gym you know, every single day, sometimes, sometimes, you know, you're in your groove and you're like, I can't wait to get to the gym. But every now and again, you'll have your moments where you're like, I am not feeling it. And being able to push through that, being able to get your ass up, get into the gym and get to the other side of that, uh, that hurdle that you may experience, that is going to build more resilience within you. If you watch this video up to this point, I really appreciate you. If you're getting some value out of this, please hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Now, for the last way that the body game makes you stronger on the inside is that you develop a stronger sense of self. You develop a stronger perception of yourself. 
you also gain a better sense of your limitations. You gain a sense of what you can, what you can't do, your ability to challenge yourself, your ability to push more weight in the gym, which allows you to push yourself more in day-to-day -day life. If this video provided you with any value, again, hit that like button. Be sure to check out my other video where I talk about the body game and six ways that it will improve your life starting today. All right, I'll leave that one up here. All right, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.